Okay, so here we're looking at fractions, okay? Okay. A fraction is a part of a whole. So a fraction can... Why do I need to learn this? Well, you're going to be learning this in math, okay? But what am I going to need it for in my life or something? So when we're looking at these fraction circles, first I want you to figure out how many equal parts is this um, broken into, this first circle. This so number one. Two. It has two parts, you're right. So if I were to color in... Okay, I'm going to color in. Can I do this? Yeah, let me just do the first one. Can you keep this in rainbow? Uh, no, we just have to choose one color. If I Let me do the first one. If I color this side in, yes. okay, let's pretend the whole thing is shaded in. How many um, sections are colored in? How many parts did I color in here? One. Only one, exactly. So we would write this as a fraction, and I'll show oh, you how to write this. Okay. So for number one, the fraction would be written as one, I colored in one section out of, how many sections were there? Two. So the fraction is one out of two. Okay, we're going to do another one. Let's do another one. Number two is going to be this one. Okay. For number two. Yes, I need to put it on carpet. Okay. How many sections were colored? Any better one minute. How many sections were colored in? How many sections were colored? Were shaded in? Two. Good. Three. Two out of? How many sections are there all together in the circle? So I would write this as two out of three. That's the part that's shaded. What about number three? I'm going to shade this. This part. How many parts did I shade in for number three? three. Good. I shaded three out of. Why are you doing this? How many three? did I shade? Three. Three out of. Four. Good. Okay, let's do this one a little different. I'm gonna shade in. Four. Just this part. For number four, how many sections did I shade in? One. One out of. Four. Two. How many sections are there all together? Four. One, two, three, four. Five. I shaded. I this doesn't count. This does count. I shaded one all together. There's one, two, three, four, five sections all together, right? Just like over here, this one, where there was one, yes. two, three sections, and I shaded two out of the three. For number five, how many sections do you want me to shade? You tell me. Seven. One, two, all three, four, five. Six. Six. Okay, so number five. How would I write this as a fraction? I shaded how many? How many did I shade? Six. Six out of? Um, zero. No, how many sections are there six. all together? Six. That's actually a whole. The whole thing was six out of six. Okay, for number six, I'm going to shade this. How many sections did I shade for number six? Four. I shaded four out of? Four. Oh, no, there's way more than four sections here. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. So I shaded, look here, what is four out of eight. You just wrote six fractions. This is a You're showing the parts out of the whole. This is Next example, I want you to show me a fraction. The fraction is one out of four. Yes. Does this have four whole parts? No. One, two, three, four? It's out of four. How many do I have to color in to make this fraction correct? One. One. So this shows me one out of four. Can you show me two out of five? Good. How do I know that this is two out of five? How many did you color in? Two. One, two. And how many sections are there all together? One, three. two, three, three four, four five. five. So you colored in two out of five. Five. 